And just like that, we are back. I'm Duncan from Auto Shine in Tintin, and this is the brand new Volkswagen Caddy. Volkswagen have always been known in the UK for, and Europe and further afield as being the pinnacle for the vans with their transporter. So the fact they're now partnering with Ford comes as a bit of a shock for a lot of people. This vehicle's in with us for a few things. We're going to go through that in a moment. And we're also going to go through what we love and what we hate that now this van is basically also just a Ford. Seems weird to say that, but let's get on with the video. Now I've been a bit clickbaity out there because I was winding you Volkswagen fans up. And that is because this van is very, very much still a Volkswagen and not Ford. I'm going to go into far more detail about that in a second, but let's talk about what we're doing now. Paint protection film, PPF. Some of you might be thinking, why is he doing all this to a van? But firstly, this is a very, very nice van. And secondly, vans are not cheap. This is an expensive van. They all are nowadays. With paint protection film, if you spend a considerable amount of money on a vehicle and then all you're gonna do is worry every time you use it, what's the point of buying it? There is none. So paint protection film will take that worry away because it's gonna protect the paint and it's still gonna look like a new van in 10 years. Without the paint protection film, in about six months, it's gonna be chipped, it's gonna be scratched. The paint protection film is just going to make it allow it to look a new van for 10 years because that's how long the warranty is. We are putting the film on the entire front end. Guys are just cutting it out now so it's all going to be, we've got computer cut templates so it's millimetre perfect, all this, no knife cutting, anything like that. We're going to do all the vulnerable areas, bottom of the doors, mirrors, importantly this area because on vans you always see the stone chips on there, they've gone rusty. It's then going to be paint corrected to get rid of all the swirl marks. Then it's going to be ceramic coated and finally we are going to put a load of other bits on that are in the back of the van. So enough of me rabbiting on, let's get the PPF on. talk about the similarities between this and the Ford Transit Connect but I can't go any further without talking about how good this van looks now. We've done obviously all the bits that we've shown in the video so the PPF, the coatings, the polishing. We've also installed these roof bars and we wrapped them gloss black so they match the other bits we fitted which are also gloss black and now it really really does look incredible. We can't go into too much detail about the similarities between the Connect because the Connect van actually hasn't been released yet but what has been released is the Connect Tornio which is the people carry version so we have seen it as such. The similarities are it's the same shape and the same size but what they basically do they just redesign the bumpers and the lights and then they put their own interiors on. So when you get in this, it's very, very much a Volkswagen. And when you get in the Ford, you can see from the pictures of the Tornio, it's very much a Ford. So it's all just styled each to the brand. I mean, me personally, I am a Ford person. I, I like, we've got the Fiesta as a courtesy car. I just, I think, I just find Ford's more comfortable, but that's me. I know most people are actually Volkswagen. But these are very nice. You've got the DSG gearbox. It'll be interesting to find out if the Ford's got the DSG or they've got their version of the automatic gearbox. But overall, it's very much nice and it feels very Volkswagen. And that's what I think people watching this are gonna be interested to find out. It's not a Ford inside, although it's obviously shares a lot of similarities, but it's very nice. Thank you for watching guys. Let us know in the comments, would you buy the Volkswagen version or the Ford version? Interesting question. Be really interested to see what the split is between our audience. Check out the other videos on our channel. Like, subscribe and comment. We really appreciate it. It helps us. We'll see you next time.